<laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> We're here because I ordered a pair of hiking boots and they've arrived. I have plantar fasciitis and I have it pretty bad. For me, shoes typically last a few months and then they hurt too much. A friend of mine sent me a book about a year ago about barefoot running and it got me on this trend where I'm trying to have um, kind of no footbed, minimalistic footwear. So I'm trying out zero shoes. I purchased these with my own money and I got a minimalist hiking boot. I figured this would be really good for working around the ranch and I'm gonna try it out right now. I've been wearing these composite toe tabby, sh tabby shoes, tabby shoes, tabby shoes. And they have been really good, but the composite toe rubs a little bit on the inside of my toes. And while I'm kind of building up a callus to it, it's not the most comfortable thing. They're really flexible. And these are geared towards that barefoot, minimalistic shoe. So I'm gonna try it on. Make sure it fits before I put my foot on the ground. All right, I think I need about a half size larger. That's okay. If you buy these, I wear a size nine. These are a size nine, definitely size up half a size. So I will get these exchanged. I had an event coming up, so I needed a pair of shoes rather quickly because I couldn't wear the Tabby shoes for what I was about to do. So I ordered a second pair of shoes and had express shipping done and it took them about eight business days to process my return and they gave me a store credit but the problem is is they don't have anything in my size so I can't really use that store credit right now. I much rather would have had the cash back because I have bills to pay and stuff but it is what it is so I have this credit hanging out that I can sometime sometime use <laughs> hopefully soon. Today I'm going on a little adventure. I am going down to Manitou Springs, Colorado to do the Manitou Incline. It's something I've always told myself that I'm not able to do, so I'm just gonna go conquer it. I'm gonna do it and I'm gonna crush it. I'll probably be eating a slice of humble pie afterwards when I don't crush it, but I'm gonna crush it. I also got these snazzy new shoes I'm gonna tell you about. The Manitou Incline is a very popular extreme hiking challenge in Colorado. So I am in beautiful Manitou Springs, Colorado, and I'm going to do the Manitou Incline today. And I just had to share this beautiful view with you. It's so beautiful this morning. There's even leaves on the trees. We don't have leaves yet. So I'm really excited. Looking forward to this, guys. It's a beautiful day for this. The trail was built on the remains of a narrow gauge railroad that was originally built to service a hydroelectric plant in the area. So far so good. We'll see what I think after a mile. Look how far I've come already, guys. The trail goes alongside of the bar trail the bar trail is the hiking trail that you would take if you wanted to climb all the way to the top of Pikes Peak. You can also see the Pikes Peak Cog Railway from the bar trail. And the bar trail is what you take to get back down after you've climbed up the stairs. This badass lady is Brandy, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Massive inspiration. Everyone that we encountered was awesome. So many encouraging people in one place. Oh look, the steep part's coming on. Hooray! So obviously I ordered a shoe last minute. I ordered the Aptos in Geranium and it did pretty good considering it was a casual shoe. We're coming to the super steep part. Look how far I've come. 
This is really kind of amazing, guys. I recommend everyone do it at least once. Such a cool, cool hike. Look at how tall that is from one step to the other, people. This is ridiculous. You, sir, are a proper badass. This guy is insane and a proper badass. It is so steep here that people legitimately crawl up this section of stairs. It is crazy and the steps are so narrow. <laughs> My turn! I had no problem going uphill. The only time I had trouble with the shoes was going downhill. The second toe on my feet are longer than the first toe and consequently they end up banging against the front of my shoe, which sucks. That's what I'm gonna go up next. I'm more than halfway up. Yeah. No, I just gotta go up that and then some more because that's not actually the top. You got this, dude. You're kicking ass. It's Bad so much fun. <laughs> this is staring straight ahead of me. And now looking up. <laughs> oh, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Here, I, I gotta do push ups right there. That is crazy. Proper badass. Incredible people were all around us. Let's just go a little bit further. <laughs> Hi, Chip. Hi, Chip. Are you a rescue ranger? Are you coming to save me? Am I having a Snow White moment again? Hi, cutie. Guys, 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 we're almost at the almost there. <laughs> I only have a few hundred more steps. <laughs> Look, almost there. Look how far I've come. This is insane. I finished. I finished the Manitou Incline. And these shoes were absolutely amazing. What do you want? What do you want? These shoes are awesome. It was an incredible day. It took me five hours to do the five total miles. And I did crush it. I felt like I crushed it. I had great company, and I was surrounded by amazing people and beautiful scenery. I couldn't have asked for anything better than this. The shoes did pretty good. It's been five days, and I still have the bruise on my toe, so that's gonna take a little while to recover. And time will tell on the shoes, but so far they're pretty comfortable, and I like them. So that's the trail. <laughs> so final verdict on the shoes. I used them way outside their intended purpose and they did really good considering that. Definitely I need something that's gonna be more grippy around the toes so my foot doesn't slide around. So something that ties and tightens, but I'm pretty pleased. I'm not sure about the return process yet, so the jury's out on that, but overall, I like the shoes. It was not a very speedy trade. No. 
So I went all the way up there and then I hiked all the way down, down here. Holy crap. I died. I finished the whole thing and hiked four miles down the trail to the parking lot. So I feel like a badass today. Thank you so much for joining me on this epic journey. It was such a wonderful day and this was the perfect end to a perfect day. I hope the rest of your weekend is wonderful. And thanks again for watching. Love you guys. Bye.